Greetings, SEMA fans. I am in one of my favorite places in the world, and that is the truck and off-road section here at SEMA. I'm here with my friend Carter Reed with BDS Suspension. How's your show going so far? It's been amazing. Super busy. Uh, people coming in and out all week long, checking out the booth, checking out new products, checking out our vehicles, and come and grab a beer with us at the bar. For the guys at home who can't come to SEMA and grab a beer with you, tell us a little bit about BDS if they're not familiar. Yeah, so BDS has been around for 20 years. Uh, we specialize in making uh, lift kits and accessories for trucks and Jeeps, um, the, you know, the, the gamut of vehicles. We do mostly late model stuff, but we do branch back into the earlier model vehicles and uh, do everything from uh, coilover conversions, IFS kits, we do solid axle kits, uh, Jeep long arms, a little bit of everything. Now one of, the, one of the things that stands out about you guys is you put your money where your mouth is with regard to your guarantee and your warranty. Yeah, we, uh, we do. So we have a no fine print warranty on all of our kits. So uh, really what it says, if you can find a way to break it, we're going to replace it. You know, simple as that. We, uh, you know, it's, it's one of those, we don't expect everyone to use their vehicle to the point that, of breaking, but we want you to go out with confidence knowing that if something were to happen, we'll get your back. Um, on top of that, we also put a five year, 60,000 or 100,000 mile, depending on the vehicle, um, to match the factory warranty. We put a factory warranty in all the drivetrain parts, to match the warranty just to put that back. So That gives you a good feeling heading out on the trail, knowing that uh, the stuff you're running is backed up by that kind of support. Definitely. You don't have to, you know, it's, stuff could happen, but it's one of those you have to push the envelope just that far to make it happen and just know that we got your back if that does. I like having that challenge. See, see if you can break it. I dare you. Looking at your booth, you've got a wide range of vehicles here, everything from a big old Ford to a UTV. Run us through the, the vehicles you're showing off this year. Yeah, so we have a bunch of vehicles. We've got five vehicles in our booth this year, um, you know, in such a large booth to do it in. So being that we're owned by Fox, um, we like to put Fox on all of our kits. It's our premium shock. They make a very quality product um, and a bunch of different options. So going down the list, we have a 2017 Ford Super Duty. The Super Duty is an awesome platform. It's been selling really well for Ford, and the kits have been selling really well for us. We do both radius arm and four link kits for those. So we've got a truck down at the end. Uh, with a, it's a 17 F350 dually with eight inch lift, box coilovers, and uh, 40 inch tires. Next one out of that, we have a UTV for one of our sister companies showing off some of their new products. We have a Colorado ZR2, the brand new ZR2 that's been selling amazing. You know, ever, there's a lot of hype about, around that. It's you know the kind of the Raptor Slayer in a smaller package. Um, but yeah, so we have that vehicle here with a prototype five and a half inch kit with the Fox DSC coilovers on uh, 37s with trim fenders. It's awesome. It looks great. It's set up for the expedition, you know, kind of overlanding style, ready to go camp, ready to go play, a little, you know, hit the trail, do it a little bit of everything out there. Um, the last one we have down on the end is a uh, brand new Jeep built by the guys at Bruiser Conversions. Uh, it has an LS3 under the hood, and they actually put an extra axle in there, so it's a six by six. Um, it's running our long arm in the front with coilovers and Fox shocks in the rear on 40 inch tires. Yeah, we were sticking our heads under there earlier. That's a pretty cool suspension build. Really interesting how you built the six by six solid axle. It's something different. You know, it's the Jeep has been out for 11 years now doing the JK. Um, and so how do you innovate? How do you do something different? So the, the guys at Bruiser hit me up with this idea of, hey, we want to do a six by six. It's going to be something different. It's going to use off the shelf parts, but there's going to be a lot of custom work on the body and the frame. And I loved it. I, I jumped on it in a heartbeat saying, this is, the, this is the kind of project, this is how you make a JK cool again. Not that JK is not cool, but everything's been done to them, except for that. Except for that. So let's talk parts. There are a few new, new toys you've got out here on the floor that I want to touch on. Yeah, so we have several new products. Um, you know, we're always coming out, we're always innovating. Um, we're coming out with products for late model vehicles. You know, we're working on a lot of the 18 models right now. We have kits available now, as well as coming available soon. Um, but we also look back at some of the earlier models, some stuff that we might have missed. Um, a few years back, we debuted a coilover conversion for the 2011 and up Chevy, GM, Chevy and GMC HD trucks. They got rid of the torsion bars and went to a Fox 2.5 DSC coilover. And it had upper and lower arms. It rode amazing. It made it ride like a half ton truck, even though you're in a big diesel. Um, those have done so well for us, and we offered different sizes of that, that we actually had people, you know, busting out the door saying, will you do it for the previous generation? Will you do it for the 01 to 10 trucks? And uh, we were a little hesitant at first. You know, it was, it was one of those, is it going to sell? You know, how's it going to do for us? But we've, we've been putting feelers out, talking to people, and we finally said, let's just do it. Let's do a kit for the earlier model trucks. It's a much more affordable truck to put the money into to build a high quality suspension and get more life out of that because that Duramax is going to last forever. So now we have it. We have a four and a half and a seven inch kit that 
deletes the torsion bars and goes to a Fox 2.5 DSC coilover. It has an upper control arm that it replaces, as well as upper and lower coilover mounts, and then a new bracket for the lower arm to, to integrate the coilover mount. So um, we're really excited to release that. We think it's going to do really well for us, and uh, I know the market's asking for it, so it's going to be something cool to have. So Carter, with all these parts coming out, and there's obviously new demand for all the new stuff that's getting announced this year at SEMA, where can folks at home go to get some more information? So the best place is our website. It's bds-suspension.com. Um, we have everything from new product announcements to pictures to videos. Uh, you can check the instruction sheets. You can build a kit to your exact liking with whatever options we offer and get the pricing and exactly what that kit's going to be. You can find your local dealer to purchase it. And uh, yeah, it's everything you need right there. Thanks for inviting us into your booth. I'm going to go crawl around underneath that Jeep over there. Keep it tuned right here for more from SEMA.